All right, so I have three of my motors here. And what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna explain the differences that all three of these motors have, uh, e even though they're all the same, the same manufacturer. So we're gonna start with this one right here. Now all your information is gonna be on this um, tag here, or this uh, identification sticker on the side. So as you can see, this is a two-speed motor and the RPM for high is 1725 and for low it's 1150 and it's only one volt uh, 115 AC so it's not a dual voltage motor and the duty is a fan so because this was on a fan that I took off out of my uh, own home here so that's uh, all the information, well, some of it on this motor. And then we take a look at this split phase AC motor made by Dayton. And you can see on this one here also, the volts is 115 and the RPM is 1725. So this is just a one speed motor one voltage and the bearings are sleeve and it's got the same information on it as the other motor did okay and we come over to this one here and you take a look at the volts 115 and 230 and the RPM is 1725, all right? So this is a two volt motor. You can run it on either 115 or 230. And the RPM is 1725 and the duty is continuous. And this one also has ball bearings in it. So continuous could have been a pump um, maybe a conveyor, something that runs continuously, something like that. And then there's also the little diagram on there on how to wire them up for the two voltages. The low side is 115 and the high side is uh, 230. So anyway, just a quick little video here on these motors that I have and hopefully this helped somebody with figuring out what motor best fits their application so if you like this video don't forget to give it a like comment subscribe and hit the little bell in the corner so you'll be notified each and every time I upload a video thanks for watching